Good morning! It's now day four of the trip in Bulgaria and uh, we've had fantastic weather all throughout. Only one time it like heaved it down but uh, there's a mountain here and all that's as far as the clouds come. They just like stick at the mountain and then it's beautiful blue skies where we are. So we're the right side of the mountain. <laughs> bit windy mind you today, bit windy. I've noticed a lot in this region that there's a lot of half finished projects like take this hotel for example they've basically finished the whole shell of it and uh, all they've got to do is put windows and doors in it and uh, then it's a functioning hotel but they must have run out of money or the owner has uh, pulled out or something like that I don't know I wonder if we could get into it shall we go and have a look just checking there's nobody about plenty of abandoned shells of like uh, this is quite well on well developed and then they just sort of stopped making it so I don't know I don't understand why but it's not just this one there's about five down the road as well well there's even that one is just they got the, uh, the structure got the structure up and never pursued it and it's got a for sale sign on it so I wonder if they didn't get the proper planning permission or anything the building just stopped <laughs> But the structure is sound, so <laughs> let's go in. You can actually see the gaps through the walls. That's where the lift is going to be. I don't understand why they would just stop building. Unless the, the owner or investor um, just pulls out at the last minute and then got no money to finish. So I'm on the top floor now guys, I've got to see where I'm stepping. Certainly a bit windy and stuff has started to grow inside so this must have been derelict for a over a year, look, stuff started to grow. And that's the other hotel that's still looked through there. There's a bit of a draft. I quite like exploring places. This one's not that old though. I find these places pretty cool to look around. I really like doing this, especially when it's foreign. <laughs> just a little bit different even though you'll find buildings like that in the UK probably but still there you go there's my little adventure now I'm gonna go back get ready and go for quad biking it's in bit Hey, just got back off the AVI, AVT tour, which is basically quad biking tour. And it was a really good experience, but it wasn't the best. Yeah, the guys weren't really official. I would much prefer have done the, the buggy tour when that starts in July, uh, late July. So yeah, go and do the buggy tour instead of the quad biking. So just back in Razlog and uh, going to the same place again to have some food. Mm. So just had another lovely meal at Casa de Pepe. It's uh, probably the best restaurant I can recommend in Razlog. Uh, and it's so cheap there as well. Like one dish was seven lev. So the traditional meal we had last night in Bansko uh, cost an all, a lot, a lot. But then it was a good roast 
dinner, traditional dinner, so sort of expect it. But it still works out about the same going rate as you would pay in any European country. It's just that, I don't know, here is lovely food in Razlog and it's dirt cheap, amazing. So there you go. That's the end of day four. I wouldn't recommend the four before quad biking. Um, there's a much better buggy one buggy ride that you can uh, check out in this region. You know I mentioned in a last video about is it a Bulgarian thing that they don't bring the food all together um, so there's always people left out or stuff like that eating watching people eat but no it's just that it depends on what you order so tonight um, in my party uh, we all had sort of chicken dishes so it all came out on time and it did the night before as well when we had the traditional Bulgarian stuff so yeah false alarm that's not a bulgarian thing it's just how the chef does it and how they just deliver it so yes i hope you enjoy these vlogs so far i really suggest you come to this region in bulgaria i'm just loving it and yeah stay tuned to join the expedition